Hello Sagittarius, how are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are going to be doing your next person coming towards you in love reading and everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings. All of that is in the description box below for you. Let's take a look and see what is going on for you guys. We're looking at the next person coming towards you in love, Sagittarius. All right, we have the star, the ace of wands, the justice, the ace of cups, the six of cups, and the Four of Wands. So you guys have the death. So the death part is the overall energy here. Now we have it with the Nine of Wands, the Three of Swords, the hair font in the reverse, the hermit, the world, the three of wands, and the three of cups. Got two threes right next to each other. Threes are about creation and expression. I definitely feel like somebody here has something that they want to say to you. Um, I feel like they're waiting, like there's something that they kind of been waiting on. Um, to be yeah, even here like the seven of pentacles can also be a card of waiting the three of wands can be a card of waiting here I'm gonna be honest here I, I definitely feel like this is somebody here that's like either waiting for something to come to an end between you and somebody else or waiting for you to heal okay you, this could like you could already be in separation from a person but they're waiting for you to heal from it they're waiting for you to move on from it okay and um, they're like trying to wait for the right time here somebody definitely feels like they can give you more and do it better than the last person that you were with that's kind of the energy i'm feeling so to me this is like somebody who i feel like this is somebody who's already in your energy this could be a friend this could be somebody at work okay a co-worker because I feel like they already have kind of a general idea of what you've been through in the past with somebody here. With this death, death energy, they could see that you tried really hard to make something work uh, with a person and you just kept ending up hurt because somebody that you were dealing with in the past was very non-committal, okay? Um, or it could have been a really messy divorce for some of you. And I feel like they've just been kind of like watching it all. The hermit to the world energy, just kind of like watching it all, waiting for it to close out, waiting for you to be like ready to start to date again, you know? Um, and it's like, man, I would, I would have put so much more into this. I would have done this. I would have done that if I was them. If I was them, that's kind of the way, like the way I feel here. Uh, somebody has a lot of attraction for you too, but they've been kind of waiting to see about taking action. So interesting. We have the star card here for the way that this person views you. Like I said, this person could view you as like their wish, like something that they just really, really want. Um, but they could also view you as somebody who is healing, okay? Maybe that's why they've been trying to be patient here. The Ace of Wands for their feelings. So somebody feels a very strong attraction and chemistry towards you. Somebody really wants to start things back up. Like you make them feel excited. You make them feel electric. Their intentions, they have the Justice card. So I definitely feel like somebody has good intentions with you, absolutely. But I also feel like somebody has the intention of being honest with you about how they feel. We have the Ace of Cups as a challenge. This person is definitely concerned. One that for some of you guys, maybe it's that you're not going to feel the same way that they do romantically. Because um, the Ace of Cups, when it's in the challenge, can talk about unrequited emotions. So they could have a fear of that. Um, the Ace of Cups could just talk about, you know, a new opportunity in love in general they could feel like maybe you're not i wonder if i wonder if you know sagittarius is really ready for that they have the six of cups for their next actions and behaviors you know to me i just feel like this is this person kind of it feels a little uh wistful to me like and not in a and again in a positive way but like thinking about like conversations that you guys have had and moments that you guys have shared and you know that's just kind of like on their mind while they're kind of waiting here now this is the next love coming towards you so obviously they are and we can see that coming up as well with this justice energy being their intention it's like they really want this but 
you know, trying to wait and give you your time. We have the three of, or the four of wands here as well, which I do like that we go from that three to this four. Uh, it says there's going to be some kind of action and progression here. Now, the four of wands talks about stepping into a new chapter, reaching a goal, a finish line, an accomplishment, a celebration. It's Venus and Aries energy. It's lovely. So to me, this definitely looks like, you know, you can be getting ready to have something, you know, a brand new start with this person here, or step into a, a totally new chapter with them. Now, the signs that I'm seeing for you, I see Scorpio, I see Aquarius, I see all the fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sag, Libra, all the water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and Aries. So those are the signs I'm seeing, but it could be any, okay? It is a general reading, so even if I did not mention a specific sign, this reading can definitely still resonate for you, okay? Um... But that is what I have for you. I do hope that this helps. If it resonates, let me know. If it doesn't, that's okay. Just check out your other placements and everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings, all of that is in the description box below for you. And if you want personal prayers for any reason, just put a little prayer emoji in the comments down below and I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, thank you guys for being here and I will see you next time.